Hello, I am Girish Kishnani. And you are watching, 5-Minute Learnings. This is the seventh video in the series of Cognitive Biases, we shall focus on the halo effect in this video. The halo effect is the tendency for an initial impression of a person to influence what we think of them overall. Also known as the physical attractiveness stereotype or the what is beautiful is good principle, we are either influenced by or use the halo to influence others almost every day. For example, thinking people who are good looking are also smarter and funnier than less attractive people, believing that products marketed by attractive people are also more valuable, thinking that a political candidate who is confident must also be intelligent and competent. One factor that may influence the halo effect is our tendency to want to be correct. If our initial impression of someone was positive, we want to look for proof that our assessment was accurate. It also helps people avoid experiencing cognitive dissonance, which involves holding contradictory beliefs. Your overall impression of a person impacts your evaluations of that person's specific traits. He is nice, he is also smart. Perceptions of a single trait can carry over to how people perceive other aspects of that person. Physical appearance is often a major part of the halo effect. However, it can also encompass other traits as well. For example, people who are sociable may also be seen as more likable. The halo effect makes it so that perceptions of one quality lead to biased judgments of other qualities. The term itself uses the analogy of a halo to describe how it can affect perceptions. When you see someone through the lens of the halo effect, you are seeing them cast in a similar light. That halo created by your perception of one characteristic covers them in the same way. Psychologist Edward Thorndike first coined the term, the halo effect, in a 1920 paper titled, The Constant Error in Psychological Ratings. In the experiment described in the paper, Thorndike asked commanding officers in the military to evaluate a variety of qualities in their subordinate soldiers. He found that high ratings of a particular quality correlated to high ratings of other characteristics, while negative ratings of a specific quality also led to lower ratings of other characteristics. One study even found that jurors were less likely to believe that attractive people were guilty of criminal behavior. However, this attractiveness stereotype can also be a double-edged sword. Other studies have found that while people are more likely to ascribe a host of positive qualities to attractive people, they are also more likely to believe that good-looking individuals are vain, dishonest, and likely to use their attractiveness to manipulate others. Impact of the halo effect in education, teachers may interact with students differently based on perceptions of attractiveness. In a research it was found that teachers had better expectations of kids that they rated as being more attractive, the halo effect can influence how teachers treat students, but it can also impact how students perceive teachers. In one study, it was found that when an instructor is viewed as warm and friendly, students also rated them as more attractive, appealing, and likable. Impact of the halo effect in the workplace There are a number of ways that the halo effect can influence perceptions of others in work settings. It is one of the most common biases affecting performance appraisals and reviews. Supervisors may rate subordinates based on the perception of a single characteristic rather than the whole of their performance and contribution. For example, a worker's enthusiasm or positive attitude may overshadow their lack of knowledge or skill, causing co-workers to rate them more highly than their actual performance justifies. The halo effect can also have an impact on income. A study published in the Journal of Economic Psychology found that, attractive food servers earned approximately $1,200 more per year in tips than their unattractive counterparts. Job applicants are also likely to feel the impact of the halo effect. If a prospective employer views the applicant as attractive or likable, they are more likely to also rate the individual as intelligent, competent, and qualified, Impact of the halo effect in marketing, marketers take advantage of the halo effect to sell products and services. When a celebrity spokesperson endorses a particular item, our positive evaluations of that individual can spread to our perceptions of the product itself. The reverse halo or the horn effect, as the name implies, the reverse halo effect occurs when a person judges another negatively based on only one known characteristic. 
that single trait can overshadow all of the other qualities for someone experiencing the reverse halo effect. For example, a person might assume that someone they view as unattractive is also unkind. That's all on the halo effect from my side, in the next video we shall learn about, the self-serving bias. Hope you found this video useful, if you liked it, give me a thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel, 5 Minute Learnings. And do remember to hit the bell icon, to get notified of the new videos, thanks for watching.